let's try one question asked in j exam the question is uh, if abc be real and if uh, ax square plus bx plus c is equal to 0 has uh, two real roots alpha and beta where alpha is less than minus 1 and beta is greater than 1 then prove that 1 plus c upon a plus modulus of b upon a is less than 0. So, we have this quadratic equation having roots uh, alpha and beta. We have to prove this inequality. Now, from the terms in the inequality c upon a and b upon a, from this I get I should divide given quadratic equation by a. So, I have quadratic equation x square plus b upon a x plus c upon a is equal to 0. I modified the equation from the condition which I have to prove. So, the corresponding quadratic function is uh, this. Let us draw the graph of this function. Again start with the coefficient of a which is 1. So, graph is concave upward. Also the equation has roots alpha and beta. So, graph must intersect x axis at two distinct points alpha and beta. So, here we have graph alpha and beta are roots. Now, uh, alpha is less than minus 1 and beta is greater than 1. So, where you locate minus 1 and 1 on x axis, where you locate? Obviously, minus 1 must be here somewhere between alpha and 0 and 1 here between 0 and beta. Now, we want roots to be like this alpha less than minus 1, beta more than 1 and we have placed minus 1 and 1 between roots. But for that some conditions are required. Automatically minus 1 and 1 do not fall between roots. When this occurs? When f of minus 1 is less than 0. You can see f of minus 1 is uh, negative. Similarly, f of 1 is less than 0. So, we have 1 minus b upon a plus c upon a less than 0 and 1 plus b upon a plus c upon a less than 0. Okay. Now, if we combine this two conditions, we get one condition 1 plus modulus of b upon a plus c upon a less than 0. So, you can see how these graphs are useful to solve this type of questions. In fact, the graphical analysis and graphical study make this problems too simple because everything is visible when you plot the graph.